Hi guys and welcome to another vlog. This is the Toyota Hilux Extreme off-road concept. It says that boldly right there. And this car can power almost everything because firstly it has got a port right there. Plus it has got so many lights that the sun can actually take a vacation. You can see the headlights are bright enough. Oh my god. And then fog light. Two lights here, light by there, two lights on the hood as well and six of them on the top. Absolutely crazy. It looks huge. It has so much presence as well. Get this off-road bumper which means that approach angle and all has improved as well. And there are towing hooks which are nice metallic ones. There's this towing bar as well. I think it works with the winch or probably, I don't know, I'm not too sure. You got an engine guard. There's this blue color thing. I think it's running on portal axle or what? Probably yes, because look at the clearance. The ground clearance is absolutely crazy. You get a snorkel as well. So let's quickly get inside through this, you know, fake off-road patch. But the size of the it's like the Hilux is crazy in fact okay don't get distracted focus on the car because this one is powered by of course a 2.8 liter diesel engine which produces 500 newton meters of torque and 200 horsepower in fact i've driven this car and i found it not to be very fast because it's very heavy but with all these accessories it's going to become even heavier it's a pricey car it's quite expensive and these mods will easily cost you maybe 15 20 lakh rupees i'm not sure if toyota is going to offer you all these accessories as an option because they usually just show things to create hype and that's what seems to be the case here as well and you can see red colored suspension no the rear one is orange the front one is red of course massive wheels look at the size of the tires it's absolutely in freaking Saying I can't even read the specs if you can understand something let me know in the comment section below yeah <laughs> it's crazy oh my god look at that canister for the suspension absolute maddening there's a mirror here which is useless and yeah exposed screw bits the lights I was talking about yeah oh crazy amount of lights why have they overdone it I have no idea this black panel this is antenna here to maybe talk to NASA or something of that sort let's go a little lower down well that's what she said and then you can see the crazy ground cleanse, super wide tires as well. Amazing. <laughs> this is an expensive car and when you do all these mods, it's going to become more expensive. But I'll tell you a trick to actually save money when you buy a new car and that is by buying your own car insurance. So it's not mandatory to buy your car insurance through a dealer. You can buy it directly from the insurance company and that can result in you saving money. So buy directly with ACO because when you do that, they charge zero commissions because of which your premiums become lower and ACO is obviously a tech I mean, it's tech first and being a tech platform, you can manage almost everything on the app, which is fantastic. You can save up to 45,000 rupees with your car insurance using Echo, of course. Now, this is a bit <laughs> loose. I might just trip into it. I don't know how this car is surviving there. Anyways, download the Echo app right now to get your car insurance from Echo and save money. And then, you know, they have actually given insurance to 8 crore Indians and settled 2 lakh claims, which is absolutely crazy and insane as well. Anyways, you've got a towing hook like everywhere. So that is probably to take a caravan or something of that sort. Toyota written right there. You've got spare tires too, two of those. Yeah, that's a little excess, I know, because this car's tires are such that it won't need it. Oh my God, they've placed lights here too. Absolutely crazy. I'm baffled by looking at the kind of accessories this car has but honestly this car is so popular abroad that there are so many accessories available for this particular car so let's quickly have a deco into the interiors there you can see almost everything is the same you've got these red bits almost everywhere red bits around the gear lever as well and then the steering gets a cover and this red thingy there probably it gets a what camera yeah seems like for the GPS the dash cam and uh, seats get this red treatment as well there is no sunroof here so not much adventurous on the inside other than the red bits which actually improve the sportiness and they've also added these uh, things and there's a rain visor as well space at the rear is decent but red colored seat belts actually improve the performance everybody gets ahead thankfully but the recline angle of the seat is not that great because of which obviously you sit upright which is not comfortable at all and uh, here you can see <laughs> crazy tires let me see if i can actually step in here yeah i can actually but it is actually going down so if i step in there it <laughs> goes down so that's a little scary in case you run out of fuel that's not a problem because there's a jerry can right there so we are going to head to the other side if it can take the weight of the hilux it can definitely take my weight as well 
oh there is a shovel right there which is an interesting thing how do you climb in like you need a ladder to climb in because that is the crazy height of the vehicle and there is some stuff lying on the roof because there is storage space there as well i'm just a little scared of this fake stuff but then come on i need to trust my instincts the mirrors have been pushed out quite a lot <laughs> using this and obviously you got two of these here which is kind of nice let me open the door and show you obviously driver gets electric adjust some additional buttons have been added here and there and the car is actually powered so you can see things are very similar to what we have seen in the innova crista that is not the high cross and the fortuner in fact it uses the same imv platform and there you can see everything seems very similar in fact i have been told to move out from here because they think that the fake rocks and everything will collapse and there is this reflector which by the way is mandatory on such cars so you have to put it ahead as well as behind and that is i think from 3m of course so guys quick look at this crazy hilux i just hope they probably make it one day and if they do that that will be really awesome sure. crazy ground clearance look at the ground clearance i'm not kidding you can actually take a glance up from below without even like damaging the roof or anything of that sort i really like it this is a monster truck but you know what you launch this i mean you launch this exact concept as a production model kerala police will come and take the car away say like this is not allowed no 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 why are you doing this so that's something we have to consider as well if you like this vlog make sure to give the thumbs up that's a like button and let me know in the comment section below what do you think about this mad hilux i think it's absolutely amazing someone should make one of these and drive it on the road so that it's going to scare everyone i'm not kidding This fortuner is scared right now because this guy is standing right behind and on that bombshell stand. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this vlog, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Bye.